Hi, I'm Falcony Bai Parikh, solicitor and partner at Smart Move to UK, a division of Smart Move Immigration. In this video, we're going to speak about three common mistakes that happens once applying for family migrations. I've been practicing since 2007 and have assisted thousands of clients in their UK immigration and nationality applications. We've come across very many clients who come to us after they have been refused their UK visas, particularly under the family migration category. These are the three common reasons that we have concluded over the period of time that I wish to share with you today in this video. The first reason is the assessment of the eligibility. A lot of time I find out that there is not a proper assessment which has been done in terms of the eligibility of the applicant to make an application under this category. And this becomes a very, very good reason for refusing the application under this category. For instance, you could be a tier two dependent, but you apply for a spouse visa. This could be a reason because it's a wrong category that you have applied altogether into. The second reason is insufficient documentation. There's a lot of time an assumption to say, oh, because I have traveled lots of time in past, they would have the information. I don't need to provide these documents over and over again. And this becomes another good reason for refusing the application because there's insufficient documentation for the assessing officer to make a decision in your favor. Sometimes it's also about missing the information that you had to provide them to give the decision in your favor. So the third reason here is the lack of information which has not been provided in support of the applications. For instance, there is a previous marriage which is in place and that's been dissolved and the applicant forgets to enter in or submit the divorce decree. This becomes a good reason for refusing the application. Sometimes you have a long travel history and there's an assumption to say, since my passport has been submitted in support of the application, it very well confirms all my travels. I need not mention that there also becomes a reason for refusal. So these are the three common mistakes that nine out of 10 times happens when you're applying for an application under family migration category. Also, the Home Office statistics says that one in four applications have been refused under this category is the reason why this video is the most important video that we thought we had to do. I hope you found this informative. Keep watching our channel to find more such videos. Thank you very much for watching this one. Bye-bye.